Production Studios. Yes. Go ahead and send them in. Thank you. Hello, how can I help you? You must be the new assistant. Perfect. Well, my name is Alex, and what was your name again? Okay, let me pull you up in the system. And did anybody go over all the specifics with you yet? Okay, well, then I will run through everything with you so that you're all caught up on everything that you need to know. Is this the first major motion picture you've worked on? Okay, well, then you are definitely in for a treat. This movie you'll be working on has a lot of celebrities. Oh, yes. <laughs> a lot of big names in the business. And it is so exciting that you get to be a part of it. So, let me see here. Did you park in the lot or on the street? Okay, let me go ahead and start by getting you a parking pass so that you can park in the lot, okay? And I will have to call the parking office real quick. One moment, please. Hi, Janine. Mm-hmm. I'm good. Can I get a parking pass made for the new assistant? Okay, perfect. I will send over all of their information, just the usual form, and a copy of their ID. Okay. Mm-hmm. And when will you have that ready by? Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. I'll send Tony over to go get it. Perfect. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Okay, so, yes, I will need your ID. So, I can send that over. Thank you. And let me go ahead and type in some of this information from your card while I have it. from the security office. Yes, it should, it should be ready in about a couple minutes. Okay, no problem. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, we will get that very soon. And I sent over all the information for that. So, you'll have your parking pass. And... You are also going to need a badge to show that you are with the staff. So let me go ahead and get one of those printed for you. And I'll just use the photo that you sent along with your application, okay? Okay. And we'll print that out. And it's all ready right here. Here you go. And you need to make sure that you have that with you at all times when you're on the premises, okay? Good. Yeah, they won't let you anywhere without that badge. And um, if you lose it, 
Uh, you'll have to come back here so I can print you another one, okay? Good. Um, and did you sign an NDA yet? Okay, let me get that for you. Yeah, everybody who is on the set needs to sign this. Um, it basically covers, um, sorry, a lot of papers here. Um, it basically goes over, um, how you cannot video record, take photos, or talk about anything that is happening on set. So, you'll need to sign this. Yes, it's like a contract, um, just so we don't have any information out to the public before the movie is released. So let me just highlight these parts where you need to sign and the important parts that you need to read. So again, this is basically stating um, there's absolutely no cameras allowed on the property, no personal cameras. You can have your cell phone with you. Um, it is actually encouraged because we might need to get a hold of you, but just make sure you're never taking any pictures or videos and keep your phone on silent. And again, do not share any information with anyone outside of anybody on the lot. And also, as I mentioned before, there are a lot of big name actors working on this film, so I know it is very tempting to ask for an autograph or a picture, but we really ask you not to bother the actors at all. Mm -hmm. Yes, unless you are assisting them in any way. Otherwise, no personal contact with them. I know, I know. <laughs> yeah, you'll get used to it. Okay, so just sign at the highlighted parts, and here's a pen. Great. So yeah, sign right there. And initial here. And signature down here. And another initial right there. Perfect, thank you very much. And we will put that away in your file. Oh, and did you get a map of the property yet? Okay, let me grab one of those for you. here is extremely large, so in order to get around, um, we have drivers that drive around golf carts, so if you ever need a ride to anywhere on the property, you'll have to call the, you'll have to call the transportation office, and let me get that phone number for you. Okay, let me write it. transportation office and again you'll use that anytime you need a uh, golf cart transfer to anywhere on the property um, that's not in walking distance so I'm my teeth and let me figure out where they want to meet you today I can point it out to you on the map. Um, let me see here who you're working with. Okay. It looks like 
somebody didn't update who your supervisor is. So let me make a phone call real quick so I can figure it out. Hi Ryan, it's Alex. I have the new assistant here and I was looking on the Google Doc and I'm not seeing an updated supervisor role for them. Okay. Okay. Just wait for that. Yes, I'm here. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes. Let me write that down. Mm-hmm. And eight, four, five, three. Okay. All right. I'll give them a call. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay. And one more phone call. Hello, Taylor. This is Alex, yes. Um, I have the new assistant here, and I heard from Ryan that you are the supervisor. Okay, and where would you like to meet the new assistant? Okay. 42. Got it. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, so your supervisor will be Taylor, and you'll be meeting him at Lot B, Stage 42. And let me show you where that is on the map. So, as you can see here, um, we are right here where this star is. Right here. And over here to the left. This is lot A, and lot B is here, and lot C is over here. So you'll be here on lot B, and this covers the entire perimeter here. And all the stages are in order from the entrance from lot A. So 42 would be all the way over here. Yeah, so it's quite a distance. So again, you have the transportation number on that post-it, so you'll probably want to call them and ask for a ride over there. And so they'll drive you over there. And, and same for on your way back, you'd call that number again to get a ride back. Okay, so and on this map, you can see we also have the restrooms labeled. They are trailer uh, restrooms for the staff. They are right next to the celebrity trailers. Um, make sure you use the staff bathroom and not the talent bathroom, um, just so there's no mix-up. Uh, but you'll see. And the lunch tables are over here. And all the food here is catered and it's free. Mm -hmm. They have anything that you could ever imagine. So when you're hungry, you just give them your order and they will make anything you like. And on very long shoot days, we might have two or three meals. Um, shorter days typically would be one meal, but there will be a few days where we will be working um, maybe 12 hours or more, so those will be very long days, but I promise they will keep you well fed. Okay, and that's about it for the map, and you can take this with you. what 
what else we need to go over so we went over NDA and oh and if you are ever running late for any reason you need to call me immediately do you have my number no okay let me write that down let me give you this post-it that says where you need to go just in case you write down my number and make sure you put this in your phone and again my name is Alex and and again if you're ever running late last minute um, you need to call me immediately so then I can let the production team know and I will let them know and I'll figure out if they can begin filming without you it's just so we don't hold up everybody else on the production, okay? you won't be in trouble, but please make sure that you are here on time unless it's an emergency and in that case, we really do need a phone call again, make sure that you are very quiet on set um, even when the cameras aren't rolling uh, we do need everybody to be quiet because there's a lot going on behind the scenes and if something goes wrong, everybody needs to be able to hear what's going on so that also means limiting um, personal conversations but there will be a lot of downtime so personal conversations are fine we just ask that you keep your volume to a minimum and to always be paying more attention to your surroundings rather than the conversation Oh, you are going to have so much fun, trust me. Okay. <laughs> oh, also on the map, if I could just have it again, sorry about that. You'll be working with several different departments, so it's actually very useful to know where these departments are. So over here by lot C, we have a very large props department. It is two large buildings filled with props that you might need to get and in that case, you will have to contact the props department for them to have the props ready for you outside of the building and then um, the golf carts are able to transfer um, are able to transfer the props so you call the transportation office, just let them know beforehand that you need to make a delivery and they'll know to make space to bring props with them and so you'll get a ride with them there and you will be the one um, loading the cart with the props and bringing them back and setting them up with the props department and for the makeup department, we actually have several makeup locations um, all around the property so this one is the closest that is by stage 42 which is where you'll be today so you could just walk over there if you need to walk any of the actors to the makeup room or if you need to get them if it is their time to be on stage then that might be where they are and right next to the makeup department is the costume department um, this is where the changing rooms are this is not the larger warehouse for costumes that we have that is actually more over to the right in lot C so if you ever need to pull costumes from there um, it'll be over there so just remember that and you most likely will not need to worry about the technical department or electric department so we won't worry about that for now but those are the three main departments you'll be working with oh, one moment production studios, this is Alex Mm -hmm. Oh, it's already time. 
Okay, um, well, I will take the usual. Okay. Oh, wait. I have the new assistant here. Um, let me get their order. What would you like from craft services? Mm-hmm. Again, they'll make anything, anything you want. Okay. They would like a veggie burrito. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Okay, and just like that, they will call and they'll always ask what you'd like for food. So, they'll bring it over to lot B when you head over there. Okay, let me see here. So, you'll be getting your schedule. Um, for every week at the beginning of the week on Sunday night, we will be sending an email, so make sure that you're on top of that. Um, cause, because the schedule will change, it could be on a day-to-day -day basis, so every time before you come into work, you also want to check the email just in case there are any changes to the schedule. And as I said, there might be some days where we could be here for 12 hours or more so you might want to keep that in mind before making any plans ahead of time yes and this project we are hoping that it will only go on for about six to seven months we don't have an exact time frame yet um we're hoping for six though but there are always changes, so we can never be too sure. Um, let me see here. Okay, and let me make sure that they have a headset ready for you. Hi, Nancy. Um, do we have a headset available? Okay. Yes, I will need one for the new assistant. Okay, I'll send over the information now. <laughs> I know, I know. Okay. I will let them know. Okay. <laughs> all right, all right. Okay, bye bye. Okay, so they have a headset ready for you. You just need to put your name in the system. And there. Perfect. So you'll get that headset from the tech department. And they'll bring it to you once you're there. They'll know that you're coming. It looks like you're almost all ready to come. There is one last thing that I need to show you. So for your position, you will need to take lots of notes. So we have this notebook here for you. And you will be working very closely with the director. So you will be taking a lot of notes. So you're going to need this and a pen. Here you go. You will be able to take notes on your phone, but in case your phone dies, which hopefully it doesn't, but you will need to take notes on a notepad regardless, just so there's always a hard copy and an electric copy because the notes are really important and we don't want you to lose them. And I will be updating the sheet at the end of the night, so if you have any notes that needs to go out to everybody in the production team, just send them to me so I could add it to the email. And another thing, um, so as I mentioned, there are a lot, a lot of celebrities working in this movie, and we also have a lot of extras and staff members 
and you will need to know everybody who is working on the movie. Um, you will need to recognize their faces and know their names, um, just to make it easier for everyone on the staff so you're not constantly learning when we only have a short amount of time to get through everything. So I will need to hand you this. This is a very large booklet of all of the people who are a part of this major, major movie. Um, it has everyone's photograph and name and the contact information and you can take this and let me go ahead and flip through some of this with you. So as you can see here, we have all of the pictures of the main actors on these front few pages and of course we have the director, the art director, the writer for the script and along with co-stars and extras and everybody from the art department, from the makeup department and every single department it will be extremely, extremely beneficial to memorize these faces and to memorize these names. And I will have you take this home to memorize everything. And it would be nice if you had this memorized by tomorrow, but that's probably going to be impossible. So just Learn as much as you can, and that should be good. And I'll close this up for now, and you can take a closer look at that later. But go ahead and take that home with you, and please make sure that you bring that back. And I just have one final question for you. Um, do you have any acting experience? Okay, well, how would you like a role in the movie? You're very interested? Okay. Well, we do have an open position for an extra with a very small speaking role. And if you would like, I could set up a brief meeting with the director to see if you could get that part. Sounds good. Okay, let me set that up. And it'll just be a very, very simple audition. Um, they're just looking for somebody last minute. There's no pressure at all. Mm -hmm. And if you change your mind, that's completely fine too. Okay. Alright. Set that up with the director. Okay, and we have that all set up for you. Perfect. Okay, well, it looks like we might be seeing you in the movie then. And don't worry about your responsibilities if you do get the part. Um, it'll only be a small part, so there's no need to worry. Well, we are so happy to have you here, and thank you so much for helping us out. Make sure you call the transportation number that I gave you, and They'll also have your badge for you outside as well, okay? Okay, I'll see you around. Bye-bye.